If you want to generate out tone inside of Audacity, then you can easily do so by using the generate tone option. So to do that, you should first go on to the generate menu right here. And then you can go on to the tone option right here. Once you click on tone, what happens is that uh, you can select the waveform of which you want to generate the tone up. So you can select something like sine, square and so forth right here. So select out the waveform right here and then you can select the frequency as well. So right now it's 300. So if I were to preview this, that is how it sounds. You can select the duration from over here. So I'm going to select seconds and let's say I'm going to have it around three seconds right here. So I can type in the value from my keyboard right there. So over here, instead of sign, if I were to select square, that is how it sounds. And if I were to select sawtooth, that is how it sounds. So you can select out the uh, type of waveform you want. So I'm going to select a sine wave and let's say I want to increase the frequency to around 3000. So that is how it sounds now. So I can press OK and what happens is that the sine wave is created as you can see right here. So you can zoom in and you can see that this is a sine wave right here. So generating these kind of tones is very useful if you want to beep out words as well. So I'm going to select all by pressing Ctrl A and by deleting it and I'm going to record a phrase. So this is the uh, word that I want to beep out. So this is what I have. So I'm just going to scroll out right here. I'm going to scroll this onto the left. So if I were to press the play button, So this is what I have, the word. So I'm going to beep out the word. So I'm going to select the word right here. This is what I have. So where I want to beep this. So I've already selected this. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on generate and then I'm going to click on uh, tone right here. Once I do that, I can select out the frequency that I want and the type of sine wave right here. The duration is automatically selected. And if I were to press OK, you can see that the beep is inserted right there. And this is how my audio will sound out now. So if I were to press the play button. So that is how you can beep out different parts of words, especially if they are inappropriate. So that is how you can generate out tune inside of Audacity. So hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.